What's going on YouTube? Jeans here. Hope you guys are having an amazing day today. We are here bringing you guys a guide for Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet for the Nintendo Switch. So guys, in today's video, we're going to be showing you guys at the moment the quickest and fastest way to level up Pokemon in this game. You guys already know the deal. If you do enjoy the content anytime, make sure you support me as a content creator by leaving a like on today's video. And if you're not subscribed to the channel, take two seconds out of your day to scroll down a little bit and click that big red subscribe button. It really helps me grow as a content creator. And you guys do not want to miss out on all of my Pokemon Scarlet and Violet content. We got guides, we got playthrough, and on top of that, we got rank battle videos coming out very, very soon. But like I said, we're here to uh, show you guys the quickest way to level up Pokemon. And there is a few prerequisites. First one is going to be, you have to be able to make it to this area. So the area right here is going to be the uh, North Providence area. And it is all the way straight at the top. So if we are at the school right here, it is straight from the school all the way up top here. So it is all the way, the, pretty much the, the northest spot of the map. So if you guys are able to make it here, I put a little destination marker. That is where you guys want to go. So if you guys can make it there, you guys can do this little XP farm right here. Another prerequisite is you are going to have to have the ingredients to make a ham sandwich. If you guys do not know what they are, it is going to be the pickles, it is going to be the ham, then you're going to need mayonnaise and mustard. Those four ingredients create the ham sandwich and the ham sandwich will boost normal encounters. You guys might be wondering, why do we need normal encounter boost? It's because Chansey's spawn here, and if we can boost the chances of uh, Chansey spawning, the more will pop up and Chansey's give out a huge chunk of exp so those are going to be the pokemon we're going to be farming today and we're going to be rolling out from there plus if you guys want to earn a little bit more xp like i did as you guys can see on my arta bags right here i have the lucky egg so he gets a boost of xp just by holding that so that's another little way to actually get some more xp and then another thing is like i mentioned the ingredients of the sandwich if you guys do not have those ingredients you can actually head to the mezzagoza area and if you go to these shops right here the deli uh the deli the artisan bakery and the shirt cans right to the left of the uh the west fly zone you can actually buy all those ingredients there. So if you guys are looking for them, definitely go ahead over there. You can buy them, buy them up. But if you guys got all those things done, you just head over to this little pathway. But before you do it, you want to actually set up a picnic. And I have to be on a uh, flat ground to actually do it. But I'm going to make my way to the flat ground, set up a picnic, and I'm going to make that ham sandwich. A little bit of a ham sandwich. But something I like about the picnic is it throws out your whole team. And my team's looking good so far. Look at these boys. Look at these boys. Looking all good. Cannot wait to evolve the Pupitar and the Artifax. But we're going to go here, we're going to make a sandwich, and we're going to put all those ingredients together. I believe I have the recipe done for the ham sandwich, right? I do indeed. So there it is. Ham sandwich recipe. We're going to put it in here. If you guys do not have the recipe, you can actually just go to a custom sandwich and place the ingredients in that way. And something you want to do is not mess up the uh, sandwich either. You have to hold down A and then let it go, and then do that again and again. Because if you mess up the sandwich, you actually will make the wrong sandwich, and you will not get the boost that you are looking for. I'm going to grab my pickles. I got my ham. I feel like we need more pickles, right? The ham to pickle ratio is awful here. Give me this pickle. Ham to pickle ratio, definitely off. But there we go. Place a little bread on top. Bada bing, bada boom. Bon appetites. Stick a little pick in there. And it's all done. It is all done. The ham sandwich is done. This ham sandwich will boost normal encounters. So when we head to the area where chances will spawn, there will be a lot more. And then we just kind of go tee off from there. I'm telling you guys, as of right now, I have not seen a quicker way than this to actually... uh. Get some XP. It is really good. It is definitely really good. Especially if you got this far in the game. But I kind of like this animation right here. Dude just munches down on a sandwich. No problem. No problem. I'm going to be using my Arctobax to actually farm these guys. Uh, you could definitely use a stronger Pokemon to actually kill me in one shot. My Arctobax might not be able to kill me in one shot. But I gave it the Lucky Egg and I really want to get that uh, that XP on him. But there it is. Gives us uh, that normal encounter. And now with that, we can actually hit the right. I think it's the right. Actually, we have to pack up and go first. I was trying to run with my picnic still going. But I think if you hit the right D-pad, it should show you your encounter stuff. Yes, it gives you all your, all your meal power. So as you guys can see, we have 30 minutes of these Chansey spawn. And as you guys can see, there is already a nice little Chansey spawn over here. So I'm going to come over here and look how many there are. There's already two and we're not even like at the destination that I want to be. Look, there's another one that just spawned. We have three. So we're just going to roll here and we're just going to tee off on all of them. I don't know how long it will take for my Artabax KO here. See, Breelim can definitely tee off on these guys. And yo, Artabax, no problem. Artabax, no problem. And look at that XP. Almost 5,000 for the Pokemon that kills him. Almost 2,000 for every other Pokemon. And it is just that easy. So you're just going to run around here. Keep taking out all the chances and getting as much XP as you want. But another thing I forgot to mention is you do not want to auto battle him. You want to actually battle him like this, like a normal battle. Considering you get more XP that way. If you auto battle, you get like, I think it's like 
way less. I'm actually gonna test it out. Let's look at that. We're almost getting 5,000 on my Artabax. Let's see how much Artabax we get if he goes here. Finizin wants to learn Hydro Pump. I'll, I'll deal with it later. We're making a guide, Finizin. Finizin. We're making a guide right now. Pokemon never listen. But you guys see how much XP we're getting. And no, I have a cutscene? I have a cutscene? All right, give me a sec. With that cutscene out of the way, we can get back to the action. Look at all the chances that are spawning. We have three in this area, and as you walk along this path right here, you can constantly find more and more. So it's really, really good. I'm just going to slap up a few, just show you guys how quickly you can actually get XP. I'm just going to sit here, drop a nice little Dragon Call. My Arctobax is actually able to kill him in one shot, so this is awesome. It's another good thing that these chances are uh, first stages, so they're super easy to kill. 4, 000, almost 5,000 XP per chancy kill with the Pokemon that you were using. And then 2,000 for the rest. That is an absurd amount. And again, it is super quick. You guys are just absolutely... Like, we're just absolutely just crushing these things. Another Dragon Call. Bang. If you guys do want more chancy to counter, you can actually use an Encounter Power 2 sandwich. Which I do not know how to make that one. But there is an Encounter Power 2 sandwich if you guys want. Just look it up. I would just look it up. But again, I feel like enough chancy spawn with the Ham Sandwich where you don't even need that. You legit don't even need that because most of the time if you're doing this little thing right here the more you move the more chance you're gonna spawn there there's just a plenty amount where you do not need encounter power number two but look at that i already gained like two levels already and someone wants to learn hurricane no we're not learning hurricane hurricane is more of a competitive move i do not need it for my playthrough team but look at all these chances yo way too many chances way too many chances for me to handle but the lucky egg really boosts it so if there's a way to actually get more lucky eggs i don't know if there is give them all your pokemon Give them to all your Pokemon. Or to back. Oh, we didn't get the KO on that one. Come on, Artabax. You're better than that. This one's a little bit be more beefier. It actually killed itself with recoil. Oh, no, it didn't kill itself. I thought it killed itself with recoil damage. So there we go. Take out that Chansey. And then we'll just uh, show you guys the pathway of how many Chanseys I can. So if you guys are thinking about it, every Chansey you see is, is about 5,000 XP. So we got 5,000 XP right there, got another 5,000 right there, another one right there. <laughs> like, dude, they just spawn every time you move. And we actually ran in this one, so we might as well kill it, right? We might as well kill it. But yeah, this whole path will actually spawn chances, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure if you just go straight down the line, it just goes with chances. And I'm telling you guys, it does not take long to get Pokemon level 50 or for competitive building. So as you guys can see, my Artabax is going off. So there's a Chansey. There's another Chansey. There's definitely more that are going to spawn. Actually, I don't know if there's like a cutoff here. Nope, there's another Chansey. I'm telling you, there's just plenty of Chanseys for the XP to go around. Too many Chanseys for us to handle. There's another one. And I believe they spawn all along this beach, right? Yeah, you got Chansey here. Chansey there. Just think of that. 5,000 XP for all them Chanseys. And they legit take about 30 seconds to, to kill or to KO, if you guys want to say. But guys, there it is. There is the guide on the fastest method in this game to level up your Pokemon. If you guys did enjoy today's video or this guide, make sure you leave a like on it. And if you're not subscribed to the channel, click that big red subscribe button. Also, guys, let me know in the comment section down below if you guys want to see any other specific guides. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Peace out, everybody.